Hey everybody, welcome back. This is episode 7 of the Survival Let's Play Pocket Edition series. Welcome back. There's a dog out there. Um, so yeah, so welcome back. I've said that too many times. Um, now, uh, look at my levels. 31 levels, let's go! Yeah, look at my levels. So, I grinded. It didn't, that spider farm's pretty efficient, not gonna lie. So, that didn't take too long. So, yay. Um... Now, I'm displaying firsts of things. Like I said in episode 2, I'm going to do like a museum. So, I've got my diamond there. First diamond. And, uh, yeah. I have some more things in my chest, by the way. If you haven't noticed already. Which you probably haven't because I didn't show it. But, look at this. I'm organized. Yeah, so I'm putting firsts of things in the chests. I'll eventually find them in the future. But I'll just show you all my storage and how they're organized and stuff. Just so you guys know. For the future, um, if you want to tell me something about it. I don't know. Cobble, 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 stone, stone, stone. Diorite, granite, andesite, gravel, sand and gravel or sand. Food, armor, mob drops, misc. If you don't know what misc is, misc is like miscellaneous like something i don't have a chest for i guess books tools diamonds emeralds lapis quartz gold iron and with the diamond chest i'm putting like special items in there i guess so yeah coal glass dirt dirt or grass dirt wait glass yeah uh, redstone and just components for redstone, grass, leaves, vines, flowers, industrial blocks, dyes, slabs, stairs and walls, and other nature. And then oak, birch, dark oak, other wood, jungle, and acacia or spruce. Nether stuff, obsidian, decorations like crafting tables and all that. Just, yeah. Wool, farming materials, and end stuff when I get to that. And that's virtually all of it. So, yeah, I did get organized. I got loads of levels. By the way, she doesn't have a name yet, so I'll leave a name for it in the comments. Thank you. But today, what we are going to be doing, guys, is we're going to be enchanting here. <laughs> we're going to get some real good armor and stuff. I'm going to need lapis. Um, but, yeah, I want to enchant straight away. I don't want to die and lose all my levels before I go enchanting. Because last episode was supposed to be an enchanting episode, but... My fault, I died. But let's get our minds off that and start enchanting. So I'll meet you guys down in the enchant room and I'll see you all there. But wait. Diamonds. Now I will see you all there. Guys, I just had the scariest moment of history. I was going down the water stream and it was lagging like crazy and I thought I nearly died. I, I did the water drop. I don't know why. I'm so dumb. It's so addictive, though. Um, but anyway, we're down here now with Sparky for some enchants. Now, what would we get on a pickaxe again? I'm breaking three. That's kind of risky. Not going to lie. Hmm. Well, tell you what. What I'm going to do here. You guys are probably like, what are you doing, dude? Because what the heck are you doing? Okay, so smelt up three. Yep, that's what we need. Smelt these bad boys up and just put some more in in case we need it. But we'll smelt these up. Now, you guys are probably like wondering, like, what are you doing? Um, so, oh, you just need three, but I'm making a grindstone. Now, this grindstone's gonna take enchants off if we don't like the enchants. Obviously, we're gonna have to go grinding for more levels. But if we take it, the enchant off, we'll get like a half a level or whatever. I don't know if it's a diamond tool anyway. So I guess that's okay. Okay, yeah, we should be able to make a grind stone here. Make the slab. What are we missing? Wood. It's in that. Yeah, we don't need these anymore. Oh, I guess I'll take that. Okay. So, oh, we can make two. Hmm. I guess we can make two then. We'll put it right there. And we'll just put this over here, I guess. If we ever need it, which we're probably never going to do. But here we go. So I need to make a new diamond pick. Because I don't want to use a half broken one. 
Don't hit sparks. Okay, good. Now, oh, we're gonna only have one diamond after this. Might as well make the pick though. Okay, here we go. So it's unbreaking three. Yeah, okay. I want fortune more so we get more diamonds, but I'm okay with silk touch because we need that for the mega base. Are you kidding me? Take it off. Now we're at 29 levels. Okay, I'll see you guys once I've got 30 levels once again. This is the painful process of enchanting, but. I'll see you guys when I've got 30 levels. Okay guys, so we are once again at 30 levels. I'm gonna keep this thing on in case I get a really crappy enchant again, but um yeah, that only took like two minutes, so that's how good that farm is. I mean, if you really want to check out my episode, that's a better tutorial, but I did do a tutorial on it. I have crappy audio on it though, so if you're really keen, then you can do that. But where's my pick? Okay, there it is. I thought that I lost my diamond pick. I'm breaking three, okay. Yes! Guys, that is an amazing pickaxe. Look at this. Fortune three. That's what I wanted more than silk touch, so I can get more diamonds to make a silk touch pick. This is insane, actual. This is really good. And it's got efficiency. That's what I really wanted. And I'm breaking. This is the perfect pick. Literally the perfect pick. Now, guys, um... I forgot to say, when I do trading with villagers later in this series, probably not very close to the future, but yeah, um, I'm, yeah, I'm gonna only put mending on, like, like an elytra, just because I like the way Douglas Med does it, like, where he retires his tools, if you have mending, you can't retire your tools, they're invincible, they never break, but this is... He's not going to have mending. None of my diamond picks or any tools are going to have mending my armor either. I want to repair it all. That's the fun in Minecraft. So, yeah. Sparky, did you see that? I got an amazing pickaxe. Heck, yes, I did. I guess I don't need this thing on anymore. I'll leave those spiders in there, though. But that's one part of the episode done today. Now, you guys are probably wondering if I didn't mention already, which I didn't, I don't think. Uh, we'll sleep here. Um... I'm gonna make a fishing dock. Now, you guys are probably like, cross up, why don't you just go and build your base or whatever, you know? Well, I can't really get started on that. Now I forget why, but I, there's a reason why I can't get started on that right yet. Um, oh yeah. And, uh, what's it called? I want to build an iron farm in the very near future. I can't get started on it because it requires a lot of stone. That's what I was worried about. I was going to build this, like, around next episode and stuff, but I don't have stone. If I don't get silk touch, I can't get the stone for the stone brick that I want to use. But, yeah, so I want to build a fishing dock. Now, I'm pretty sure I could go right here because it's a little, like indention right here and then there's a massive river going through yeah i could build it right here and uh, what the purpose is this for you know how i said i wanted to get every pet in the game i want to get a cat and to get a cat you need fish fish fishing dock Ta da i know it's so creative of me but yeah that's what i want to do so yeah now i haven't really done any testing in my test world did i mention ever that i have a test world so yay cool um, but I don't know what I want to do it out of. I probably want to make it out of spruce logs and just spruce wood. I mean, it could be like one of those houses, like how their roofs are, kind of, maybe. Yeah, and then we could have a little dock out here. Yeah, that's probably what I'm going to do. So, I'm going to probably start building. I'll give you updates on, like what i do and stuff and then if we get really late into the episode or whatever um then i might end it after this but if we don't we still have lots of time by the way guys last episode i thought it was like 12 minutes long or something and i like really messed up but it wasn't it was like 18 minutes long my timer thing like i checked my timer added up and stuff it doesn't work i don't know why i'm doing i'm a good mathematician if you must know and i know my math and it didn't work 
so that's odd but at least i got a good video out for you guys so yeah i'm gonna start building this and i will see you then with an update so yeah okay guys so i've got the basic layout here this is like the foundation i guess it's gonna be indented out so i'm gonna have to make it look good from the outside i guess um and yeah i'm gonna have the dock out here the little indoor here i'm gonna have a bedroom back here the reason i'm gonna have a bedroom is because of the 1.14 update 1.14 update villagers they they like work at their workstation and there's a fisherman you see where I'm going here? So, the fishing hut, the fisherman. Um, so, with the dock, I'm going to put his workstation, a barrel out there. So, he actually goes out there and works. So, then it looks like he's actually going fishing, maybe. Something like that. And then, I'll have his little bedroom there because all villagers need beds, I guess. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure the whole town over there is dead. Oh, I completely forgot. But, if you can see on the map, I'm basing it on the map. There is a village in that plains. We can go back there and get some villagers, transport them here if we have to. That's not even that far away, so yeah, we can do that. Um, but yeah, I also had a comment. I just want to mention this. I also had a comment by um, by someone saying you should make a big bee farm. Now, yes. Um, so I wanted to mention to these guys in this episode or next. I don't know somewhere. Zombie villager. He might be from over here, maybe, but... Oh, he's dead. Sorry. Die. Please. I don't want to watch this. But, uh, yeah. So, he, um, they commented, like, you should make a big bee farm. I'm like, yes, I totally agree. Great suggestion, dude. But, um, I wanted to address this. We, in the mega base that we're going to make, probably in the mountains, I don't know, somewhere around there, I'm still deciding. Um, we're going to have all automated farms. This is why I haven't made just a crop farm or anything yet, because I want to do it automated. I might still do that, make a crop farm. I'm still not, like, certain on anything, but, yeah, that's why I'm not making too many farms or anything. I made an auto sugar cane farm, because that, that's, you need that, you know, like, you need it. Like, the majority of the sugar cane for the bookshelves I used the sugar cane farm. So, yeah, it's a good farm. The bigger, the better. And I'm going to make them so big. And, like, um, with the wheat farm and the, the bee farm, it's going to be automatic where it produces honeycomb and honey bottles. So I'm going to make it big, of course. All the farms will be big. But just to answer your comment, yes, I'm going to make them all. But once I've started the mega base, which is coming soon in the series, so be excited. But, um... Yeah, I'm going to get back to building, and I'll see you all in the next update sort of thing. So, I'll see you then. Okay, guys, so, update time. Um, yes, I've got some walls in. If I didn't, um, I don't remember, but if we come down here, we have a few chests. This is where I'm going to store my items that I get from fishing. I'm yet to make the dock, but I will. Um, got the walls in, and then, like I said, from the outside, it looks kind of... Ooh. Yeah, I'm going to fix that. Um, like I said, I'm going to have to do some fixing. I will. Um, but this is going to be like a little crafting space. The chests and the entrance. And down here is going to be the little guy's bedroom. He's going to have a uh, carpet in here. Red carpet it's going to have in here. And then like a little, a little red carpet out coming to the dock. Um, might have some furnaces here actually. Yes, to cook the food. Some smokers. And yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have like here, here here and under the carpet or his bed i should say i'm gonna have redstone lamps on and then on here because you, you can see the redstone lamps i'm gonna put some trap doors to make it look nice on top of them closed and uh yeah if i did have those some more bookshelves i'd put them here beside the bed and with some flower pots on it but i can't so i'm gonna have to figure something out there but yeah and then all i gotta do is make the roof which i have plans for and make the dock so what i'm gonna do now is probably maybe just maybe fix the outside put the roof on and then i'll show you guys an update so i will see you then okay guys so i've actually finished the fishing dock here as you can see well not finished i said finished i haven't even got the dock in it's a fishing dock and you don't have a dock um <laughs> but i've done the roof and the outside so I'll just show you quickly. It looks really cool in here. I have, like, I'm going to have a window up there, up there, 
little support beam and these I've turned I've stripped them because they match too well with that and if you look here um, these are spruce those are stripped if those had have been spruce it would have looked really weird yeah I gotta fix this up too I should do this now actually wait Um, yeah, so I put trap doors on them as well. I think I gotta go with, oh no. You know what I'm just gonna do? I'm just gonna do this. Smart. Bam. Looks weird, but you're not really gonna be looking from the fishing dock this way. So, oh no. Yeah, good. Okay, so yeah. So, yeah, I put trapdoors. Sorry if you can hear someone in the background, maybe. Anyway, you can see trapdoors here. They just add a little bit more texture. And, um, yeah, then we've got the windows here. It's kind of built into this, into the side of this hill, which I kind of like. And then you go down, you've got the trapdoors here on here. And you come down in here, you got your chests and your dock, and it looks so good. This is like one of the best builds I've ever done, so congrats, Crosla, congrats. But, um, so what I'm gonna do now is probably get the dock in and do some decorations. So, yeah, I'll see you then. Okay guys, so I have done the interior here, so if you come in, I have put some fence gates here as I'm going to actually have a villager in here, like a fisherman, and if if he can get out, zombies might get him or zombies might just come in and get him. If he's out on the dock doing work, I don't think zombies should be able to get him, plus he'll go to bed. See if I'm over here all night, like around this area, which, yeah, it's going to be kind of risky, but you know, we'll just have to do, I guess. Um... Oh, I forgot to place these. Oh, don't break. Don't break. This axe is amazing. Oh, yeah. I need another crafting table to match. Are you kidding me? I don't have the wood. Okay, everybody. This is the life of Crozza. Every day just comes out here. Get some wood. Oh, my God. That's the end of the axe. You know what I'm going to do? Oh my god, my my iPad's 5%. Okay, I've got to end this recording right now. Yeah, this this video might be out on Saturday. I'm not, it should be out Friday, but... Oh, i got to run. 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 Okay, okay, okay. So, I'm just going to... I'm just going to pause it here. Otherwise, it's going to take like a couple hours for my iPad to charge. Because my iPad's weird. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next clip. Okay, guys. So, I'm back. This is like two hours, like a couple hours later for me, but for you guys, it was like one second. Sorry about that. My iPad was about to go flat. So, this video is getting kind of long, so I'm going to speed it up a little here, kind of. Um, I'm just going to build the full dock here, and I'll see you when that's done, and then we're going to do the outro because it's getting kind of long. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you there. So, I'll see you once I've built the dock, I guess. So guys, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. If you really loved it, turn the notification bell on to never miss a video. And today, we built this incredible fishing hut. Um, by the way, that little clip off camera there, what I did was just build a dock, number one, and tie up. That's like my only lead. The other lead is tied to a horse uh well i'm using it for the horse but yeah that's that's a rare thing i got it from the wandering church just so you know i'm not cheating by the way this is a 100 percent survival world but um yeah and i also added those windows as you can see so today what we did is build this incredible dock where a fisherman will eventually live i still gotta put the barrel out here so he actually works out here but um yeah i hope you enjoyed and we also got this godly pickaxe but so I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye, everybody.